Hello guys, we will look at this thing. This orange box is a MIG aircraft flight recorder. So it is uh, very heavy. All orange for uh, high visibility purpose. You have a lever strap for carrying. You have a big electrical plug here. <coughs> you have some uh, caution uh, missiles. The model number here it is uh, KI2 51G1M. It is a little blurry. So, what do we have? In fact, it is in two parts. This part holds the uh, cartridge with uh, film, it is a photographic film, the earth of the system, and this is all the stuff to write on it. So we will first remove this cartridge. So in fact this is the only important part you want to keep in a case of a crash. It is where the data is recorded. So it can be removed easily for uh, maintenance purpose. So this uh, rod here must be the blank film. And in here you have a recorded film in a reinforced uh, housing. You can see a quite a thick cover on it. I don't know if I can remove it easily or not. No, maybe not. Not sure how it works, so at least maybe. So you have a clear here to uh, make it turn. And once recorded, the film goes in this uh, storage compartment. So, how does it work? Put it the cover back. You can see the cover here. You have an indicator for remaining uh, time on the film. So you have here a window through which the lights uh, go to right on the film. And off. So all the half of the system is in here. You can see here the matching window from electrical contacts. I'm not sure if I will be able to light uh, inside of this in order to show you somewhat better what there is inside. If this may be, let me try. No, there are mirrors and stuff in it. So we will remove the cover anyway and see what there is inside. This is not the important part you want to keep in case of crash. So it is less uh, rugged. It is a very very basic system in fact. Nothing much complicated in it. So I am not sure how it rides in the garbage, if it rides analog or uh, analog tracks or uh, digital uh, dots for uh, story. Keeping the data. You have here some uh, motor stuff. <coughs> so I believe, I believe, you have in this part some uh, galvanometers, some kind of galvanometer motors, with some kind of uh, needles. And in uh, this part here, I believe these are light uh, sources. 
maybe uh, the LEDs or the bulbs will flow up. And it goes through this part where the light is modified in some kind. Yes, it is a magnet, so there is uh, something magnetic in this, some uh, motor or something like this. And since the light is modified, it goes out to the film. You have here some more stuff. In fact, after this point, it is very complicated to take apart. Lots of small access doors, lots of screws everywhere. So I don't know if I can maybe remove this here. No, it will not move. So in fact, it is quite uh, warm, but if I take it apart further, and I'm not sure if I will be able to reassemble it after. Maybe I can just try to remove this from cover here. See what goes behind. In fact, all the screws are very, very bad and very difficult to remove. You need uh, specific screwdrivers for it. And even if uh, it's are uh, damaged, and it is quite uh, difficult to remove them, it is not the uh, standard uh, screwdriver tips you need. You need. Maybe I can just try to remove this part here. Not sure if it will come or not. Yes, maybe. Taking this uh, completely apart will be a uh, lot of work, in fact. In this here, you can access it from the housing. I think it is a reset uh, switch or something like this. You have a small bulb and uh, two switches. So here we are. If I remove this cover, we can have a better look. So we have a motor over here. Will clears coming here, some wires everywhere, some uh, precision stuff here, it seems, alignment stuff. This must be a uh, heater resistor, I believe, for uh, cold temperature uh, conditions. It is uh, written um, 27 volts. 25 watts. So just in order to, ki uh, to keep the thing warm. In fact, I have the uh, interface box which goes here, but I don't know where it is uh, currently. It is uh, stored somewhere. If I find it, I will show you it. So here we are. Very, very intricate stuff. I'm not sure if I can take it apart further. Lots of stuff down there. And really, it is well, well, well stuff. I do not know it. It is exactly, but it is quite neat to look at this. It is not something you, you see every day. So this is the MIG-21 uh, flight recorder. In fact, uh, it was used in uh, many kinds of aircraft. It is a very, very common uh, model. Thanks for watching.